Snake season is already upon us. That's usually roughly April through the end of storm season. We're already getting a lot of these storms and especially picks up during hurricane season. And the reason for that is the snake's homes are being displaced. You get heavy rains, you get things that displace a lot of debris and things like that, and their food moves or they're flooded out of their holes or their homes. If you're bitten or a friend is bitten, the most important thing is to stay calm and seek medical attention, appropriate medical attention. Come and see us, we can decide if we need to use the medicines that we have. All the commercial devices like the suction or the extraction, none of them work and they cause actually more damage. So it's really important to seek appropriate medical attention, keep them calm, don't do anything to the wound itself, and just get them to appropriate care. There are two of the biggest mistakes that most people end up encountering when they're bit or someone around them is bit. One is that they treat it like a dry bite or they assume that if the reaction's not very bad at first, that there's not venom in it. Number two is that they try to capture and or bring the snake in for identification. I don't need it. Take a picture if you can. Otherwise, just get them to care. We can figure things out. <laughs>